how have they been? Because it's relatively comfortable when you look at the leaderboard. Yeah, the first one we had a, a quite an okay feeling. It's very difficult to know if you're using enough of the, the grip in a stage like like Sistron. It's so abrasive, uh, obviously very hard on the tyre, um, but we, we seem to have a, a good clean run through it. Um, the second one then was quite a bit more more complicated, quite a bit more going on with the, with the conditions, a lot of damp and shiny tyre, so uh, it wasn't easy in there and of course there was a few slides, but uh, yeah, uh, maybe eased it off a little bit to, towards the end. Then. Just kind of reporting some little problems. Now you're back into the safety of the service park. What are they? What can you do about it? <laughs> I think you guys can. I'm going to try to solve it at least. Um, little issues. Um, looks like my team is uh, facing similar issues. So, yeah. Third place at the end of it. How do you see that going? Ah, well, for sure, it's a bit of time lost already and more than we would love. <laughs> but yeah, I think we're the road position. It, it was challenging to be faster. Uh, there was already so much uh, dirt on the road. So it's, uh, it's, it will need a lot of risk uh, to go faster than in this condition. So let's hope tomorrow we can fight a bit better. A couple of little niggly issues. You're saying that you're just pleased to be here. Just give me an insight to what that is. Uh, yeah, basically like... I don't know, eight, ten guys into the first stage, we started to have some funny things with, uh, with uh, like uh, engine behavior and, and uh, but yeah, luckily that end of the stage was quite fast, so it was not disturbing too much, but now this one was was much more twisty and a bit more changing conditions as well and, and was was a bit more struggle. Well, I'm really happy about the, the tonight, it was really nice atmosphere, especially in the stage two with the Tourniquet, where there was a lot of spectators, it was really like really nice like old, old school I would say so it was really really impressive it's not easy to find the uh, feeding straight away but obviously the car is working just very well uh, just I was struggling to finding the limit with the grip and things um, obviously grip was pretty good and I was quite um, way too careful on uh, many sections so yeah mainly I'm losing time from there but uh, like like I said on the last interview that uh, this rally is uh, not every stage pushing maximum, just uh, managing the situation and try to consistent consistent every stages and try to finish every stages. Not bad for, for a first evening, uh, first rally of the season, first day of the season. So we were maybe a bit too soft for the first one. Uh, we had a, a prevent testing uh, in the rain. So now it was a bit to get a feeling and we noticed we were a bit too soft. We correct that for the second one and this one was quite muddy uh, with some damp patches so we went a bit too stiff but now we know for tomorrow we need to be in between and uh, just build up the pace and uh, try to have a steady rally. How have they been first two stages back in the big league then? Yeah it's been uh, let's say uh, stressful like you say it's uh, two nice stages and uh, yeah just uh, getting through uh, getting the mileage under the belt it's so important and these cars uh, for sure is something different than, than what I'm used to. So need the mileage. So we had a safe and steady run through these two. And um, yeah, when the feeling is there, we'll gradually uh, try to increase during the weekend. Ledge four, right sharp, middle, into 